Hey guys, I'm your term candy taster. Today we have rare special kinder products from around the world here. I'm your German candy taster, the most accurate in the rating and I tell you if you should buy it, if you should not buy it. Guys, we have so much special stuff here. What I, guys, it's, it's unbelievable. So we will start directly with this and this is crazy, guys. This is crazy. This is Kinder Chocobongs Crispy from the United Arabian. And guys, you have to spend a lot of money to get it. So I'm super curious if it's worth it. Guys, how it looks amazing. So I spent a 25 US dollars to get these. This is how they look. Bang. Not sweet enough. Yeah, taste it. Taste it. It's too bitter kind of thing. In the rating only 7 out of 10. It's for my kind of taste. I mean, maybe you have a different taste, but not good enough. So next special edition. What do we have here? Oh, we have right Duplo. We have different Hanuta kind of flavorings. We have here winter edition Duplo. Guys, it's so much Kinderriegel, so much different stuff. And I think what is also special, not many people know that it exists, is this. This is crazy, guys. This is a um, Kinder cereal cookie kind of thing. Cookie dough. And I'm, guys, this is, look, doesn't look like a Kinder product. Guys, 2 out of 10. Yeah, it's awful. Not sweet at all. Kinder Schokofeld. Help me, please. Come on. <coughs> Give me a oh, yeah. Kinder Chupo Fresh always 9 out of 10. So what kind of special edition do we have next? Crazy Kinder Creamy. Look at this. Have you seen this before? Probably not. Um, this is basically, I don't, oh guys, <laughs> look at this. I mean, I don't know if you remember Kinder, Cre uh, a Kinder Country Cereal, that was the same. Is there no spoon? Ah, here's a spoon. A plastic spoon. Guys, interesting. Puff reis. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. It's super sweet, super creamy, super crispy, with these balls. Amazing. Guys, the cream. Wow! I mean, why didn't I eat it before? I, I, I had no idea. Basically, it was quite good. Amazing, 10 out of 10. So, what kind of special editions do we have next? Hanuta cookies, and this is one of my favorites. I, I, guys, I know it, how it's tasting. Solid 9 out of 10. You can eat it always, every day. It's great, it's good, it's healthy. It's protein cream. Guys, actually many people think Kinder products are unhealthy. But if you just take a look at the Nährwerte, quite good. 
quite good. It's quite good. So, guys, what do we? It's, it's so much. I don't know where to start. I need to, uh, damit meine Geschmacksnerven dich mal beruhigen, brauche ich wieder mal ein Basic-Produkt. Da komme ich hier runter. Let's open this one. Gigantic Kinder Surprise Eggs. Oh, guys, just a little something inside. Kinder Sugarbong for example. Einem hat sind die nämlich im Mund. Sind die auch schon weg? So, was haben wir hier sonst? What else do we have? Basic product, yeah. White Duplo. <laughs> Guys, what else do we have? So, oh, guys, next uh, 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 carnival, I go as a surprise egg. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. So, Hanuta Spekulatius. Crazy, it's from winter, but I'm not a big fan. I know it directly. I have tasted this before, yeah? And I can tell you, they put less sugary in it. Less than in the normal Duplo. Three out of ten. So, guys, as you can see, most special editions are not as good as the normal editions, and that has a reason. Yeah, the thing is, they put the special editions in a limited time, so that you can't eat too much, and then you always in the store. Like my heart, I get uh, adrenaline, I get dopamine when I see new candies. You know me and. Candy taste. I mean, look at this. This is crazy. I know. Um, but they put it only a limited time, and then you have the problem. <coughs> you can't compare it with the normal ones because the normal ones are available for the whole year. And then why? How could you ever compare it? It's unfair. Totally unfair. I mean. Let's say Kinder Surprise Eggs. Nothing special, nothing special. 10 out of 10. You got me on this. It's 10. I mean, the chocolate is so thin and so sweet. Delicious. And that's exactly what I mean, yeah? So they don't put it out the whole year, so you don't eat as much as from the normal ones. So, guys, what else do we have here in this? Oh, guys, my here, my little Kinder Surprise eggs. <sighs> guys, what else do we have? Oh, guys, Kinder Happy Hippo in dark. This is new to me also. Quite good. If you are a fan of dark chocolate, this is 10 out of 10 for you. 8 out of 10 for me. Uh, I'm looking for the um, light Kinder Happy Hippo. And this will be the last one. Uh, because this is something crazy good. Oh, there is nothing inside. Oh, guys, fuck it. Look at this normal Bueno. 
9 out of 10. Okay, guys. So, uh, you know my opinion, especially it isn't uh, usually not as good as the normal ones. Anyway, all the Kinder products are good. See you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. Hey, 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 stop it. Uh, stop it, please. Hey guys, I'm your German candy taster. So today, guys, we have different kind of Kinder products, big versus small in the comparison. So we have small ones, big ones, and we will compare them. Hey, hey, guys, hey, this will not stay there on it. So, okay, guys, let's start with the Kinder Surprise X comparison. So we have the small one and the big one big one. So I will open the small one. Everybody knows it. Can I notice what is inside? Guys, as long as there are no schlümpfe inside, is I am not interested. Does it taste good? Mm -hmm. uh, guys, the guy behind the camera is eating here, all the candies, the whole day. These are my candies. Okay, guys, so what do we have inside? We have this inside. And guys, look at this. I mean, you pay money for this and then you get this. And this is for me a joke. I also give a, um, to make it better idea. I want more chocolate inside. <laughs> guys, just imagine Kinder chocolate, kin Kinder surprise eggs like this giant one. And the whole thing is filled out with white chocolate or chocobongs cream. Guys, I would put this like this and then eat the whole day from it. But they, the guys at Ferrero, I mean, I know them, but uh, yeah, no comment. <laughs> guys, okay, so next up we have the giant Kinderriegel here versus a small Kinderriegel. And guys, I can tell you, we start with the small one. There's actually not a big difference. You will see what I mean later. Here, this is a basic Kinder with the white cream. Here, I wanted to show you. Yeah, eat it. So, what is inside the big one? And guys, for that I have to think about what I did earlier today because I already opened this. And I was super, let's say, disappointed. Disappointed, Ferrero? Please change it. Um, German candy taste, I was disappointed because there was inside was a lot of small Kinderriegel. So I already opened it and I opened it and it went like small ones and I expected this to be a gigantic one. So my kind of critique is please make it bigger the next time but you know uh, the past is the past and now is the only moment that counts. So in the moment I would say I have a lot of candy so I'm happy but yeah. Oh guys we forgot to open the big Kinder Surprise Eggs. That's easier said than done, but I can do it anyway. We have just small Kinder Surprise Eggs and also small Kinder Joy. Uh, yeah, what also is interesting, what can I show you guys? Do I have interesting stuff here? A lot of interesting things. For example, guys, what is interesting? I had something earlier, where is it? The Chocobongs Crispy, I wanted to show you. Do you know where they are? Chocobongs Crispy, basically? No? You don't know? Okay, anyway, we are going to end this video now, uh, guys. I don't uh, like this when the, the camera guy is not prepared because we had this embargo that he shows me where everything is and he doesn't know. So, uh, 
finished. See you in the next video. Bye bye. I love you, my fans, but the camera guy, not so much now. See you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. Hey guys, I'm your German candy taster today with the triple camera setup. So today I will taste every Kinder product that you can buy in the store and I'm super, super excited. And guys, I'm super curious how they are all going to taste. So we will directly start with a, a, a super weird one, Kinder Delight. I haven't seen this so many times. So this is more like a cake kind of thing. So as you can see, it's like a brownie. Guys, this is way too bitter, way too intensive, way too dark chocolate kind of taste. In the rating, only 4 out of 10. And you guys know me, I have the most accurate rating kind of thing. So guys, next up we have Kinder um, Duplo Chocolate Ripe. And there I'm also super curious how this is going to taste. Guys, I already know it, okay? To be honest, I have eaten it this before. So this is basically the whole joke about chocolate is the hazelnut cream inside. So we have cookie outside, waffles kind of thing. Inside we have cream, hazelnut cream and also hazelnut. Already better, more sweet. Super good cream inside like Kinder Bueno. In the rating, directly 8 out of 10. Way better. Okay guys, next up we have a basic Kinder Surprise Egg. And I have loved this thing when I was a little a boy. Guys, this, is, this was so good as a little boy. Because the chocolate, yeah, it's really all about the chocolate kind of thing. <clears throat> Super good. Chocolate. 10 out of 10 guys, you got me. So it's basically because it's so thin and that makes it so special. Surprise. Geschenkt. <laughs> guys, what should we eat next? I don't know if you can see all of these things here. So much. Kinder Schokobon white. I have tasted this so often, so many times. 10 out of 10 products. Just that's the Kinder Surprise Eggs. Super good. I have to eat another one, guys. 10 out of 10. I mean, it's super sweet, milk cream, perfect. Hazelnut inside. Super good, super, super good. This is big! Look at this, how big this is! I also have here another special edition. Oh, guys! This, oh, there, there, there it goes. Oh, thank you so much. Guys, here we had Kinderriegel inside. I already put them here on the thing, so this is basically empty. Just decoration kind of thing. So this is, um, I mean, looks good, but it's basically, oh guys, this is filled with little Kinder Riegel, Kinder Chocolates. Oh guys, this is already getting milked, because it's so old. This is basically chocolate. I mean, it's in the, in the kind of logical wise. It's like the Kinder Surprise Eggs, but it's way thicker. So <laughs> not even close to 10. It's basically 8 out of 10. So guys, what do we have next? I know you want to see the giant Kinder Surprise Eggs. Maybe we will... Ah, guys, Kinder Riegel in comparison. Uh, this is more or less the same as Kinder Chocolate. Um, but this is just bigger. I mean, good milk cream. Yeah. Also too big, 8 out of 10. Kinder Surprise Act is the best. Oh guys, I have to eat another Kinder Schokobon. Mit einem Hatz in den Mund. Dann sind die auch schon weg. Guys, Special Edition Hanuta. 
black and white. I like it. It's basically like, if you remember, yeah, the Hanuta milk and crispies from, I think they had it 10 years ago. Yeah, it's basically the same. Good. This is a 9 out of 10 product. Super sweet, not too intensive, even though it's very dark. It's, it's a good product. Can't say anything bad about it. Guys, next up, I'm not the biggest fan of Nutella um, kind of cream. It's not sweet enough for me. I prefer the right one, the right cream. I mean, this is basically here. This is Nutella in a... Oh, no, now that I taste it, it's good, yeah. <laughs> I give it to you, yeah. Um, but it's not a 10 out of 10 product. This is um, this is 7 out of 10 in the rating, kind of right. I mean, it's good, it's not the best. So what do I see here? Kinder Duplo right? Guys, so much candies. And I mean, everybody knows Duplo's longest pralines in the world. Solid. 7 out of 10 in the rating. Oh, guys, I have here Kinder Bueno White. This used to be my favorite kind of product. So I'm super curious. I haven't tasted it in a long, 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 long time. Guys, give me a second. I will directly give you the rating. Don't come too close. <laughs> hey, this is mean. Don't bully me for my eating. 7 out of 10. So in total you see the products are good, but the 10 out of 10s are still missing. Yeah. Guys, next up we have Kinder jo Oh guys, no, this is now, this is paper. This is paper. <laughs> what the fuck? Assholes. <laughs> come, how can I open it? Oh no, that was a toy. Guys, I'm not interested in toys. Except for adult toys. Of course. Yeah, this is a basic good product here with the cream. White chocolate, dark chocolate. 8 out of 10. Guys, I'm so sorry that so many products get 8 out of 10. But most of the Kinder products are around the same thing. But we are still looking for the 10. So what do we have next? Mm, guys, how about basical Hanuta? This is a basical taste. Quite normal. Duplo uh, chocolate, a uh, cocos. Not the biggest cocos fan, but I mean, I'm always, always interested in the limited edition. So always curious, always looking for the limited. But in the rating, 6 out of 10. <laughs> Sorry for all the fans. Nothing personal. So what do we have here? Oh, Hanuta cookies. Oh, we have here a normal Chuck Nut. Oh, guys, basic Kinder Country. This used to be my favorite. Not anymore. 7 out of 10. Sorry guys. No candy shaming, of course. So what else do we have? Oh guys! Kinder card.
And guys, Kinder Cuts is basically of a product. Cookie with milk. But very good kind of cookie actually. In the comparison to other brands, very good. 9 out of 10. Could be more cream anyway, but all with other products. I mean, cream is always the most rare in the production, I guess. I don't understand why else they would use not as much um, cream. Oh, guys, this is interesting. This is Duplo Speculatius. And this is from um, Christmas. I kept it till now. Oh, guys, forget it. Three out of ten only. Uh, Hanuta cookies is quite interesting. Kinder, guys, there is so many. Maybe you can help me deciding here what to eat next. Uh, <laughs> Funny, that's just what I ate, yeah, like 10 seconds ago. <laughs> this guy, eh, guys? <laughs> Here, this is something new. This is basically Duplo Dark Chocolate. And this is the same that we have just tasted it, but with dark. I'm not a fan of dark. Not sweet enough. Guys, I have so many candies here. Kinder Bueno. Ah, ah, I have already uh, tasted Kinder Bueno. So I'm not going to do this again. Uh, one more in this video. Guys, Hamida cookies. Kind of thing. This is good. This is good. Amazing. Simply amazing. Guys, like from the note, from the senses directly into the brain, everything is triggered from the aroma. Super sweet. Super sweet. Oh. Still only 9 out of 10. Okay, guys, see you in the next video. Bye bye. Hey, guys, I'm your German candy taster, the one and only taster in the world with the best and most accurate in the ratings. So, guys, today it's quite amazing. Today we have basically. Um, different kind of Kinder Surprise Eggs. We have the Maxi Surprise Eggs, we have the Medium Surprise Eggs, we have the... Uh, the um oh, guys my, guys, my microphone is... Guys, everything is provisorisch, basically. So I just got this on here. Guys, one second. Everything is live. I never do two takes, kind of in the ta takes. So basically, biggest surprise eggs, medium biggest, uh, medium smallest and then we have also the normal surprise eggs and we will start I know guys everyone wants to know what's inside of these we start with the basic surprise eggs normal in the in the size basically oh guys this guys I'm destroying here my whole kind of thing I put this here and we will directly check first of all Ach, this is bullshit so I will eat the chocolate. One of the best chocolates in the world. Guys, this was Kinder Bueno. It's, this is so overwhelming here. Everything that we have here. Kinder Choco Fresh. Kinder Choco Bonks in both colors. So next up we will open this one here. And as you can see, Esbara Anteil 100 gram. So we have 100 grams, it's like a normal kind of chocolate. 
And as you can see, this has more or less the size of my balls. So it's quite bigger than the normal kind of average kind of thing. And this is also, guys, the chocolate is quite old. I bought this like last year. Still good. Chocolate is always good. And guys, look at directly the difference in the toy kind of size. And guys, what do we have inside here? Oh guys, this is really high quality plastic. I can directly feel it. Guys, this is bullshit. This is always, they have the plastic parts inside. I don't like this. So, you guys know it. The reason why you buy the surprise eggs is the chocolate, because you have the milk chocolate and the normal one. One of the best chocolates. So, next up, guys. Oh, we have the same for the girls. But now we open this big surprise egg. This is a, a Christmas kind of special thing. Oh, guys, this is befriedigend. This is... I don't know the English word. Oh, guys, look. Oh, guys, look at this. <gasps> guys, this can be a mask. I can put this on my face with two, with two holes, basically. Then I, I am the living Kinder Surprise Egg. Guys, and I'm super curious if this is tasting. Phenomenal. 10 out of 10. Kinder chocolate, it gets always 10 out of 10. And oh, this is more, yeah, I, let's say the uh, German candy taster size. So let's open it. Guys, we have a look at this, something from the Avengers. And I'm the biggest Marvel hater in the world. I don't like this kind of Superman things. So, guys, this is because this was the biggest egg, I have to build it. And because there's also... But I don't like the um, construction manual. I do it always because I can do it myself. Okay. Guys, this is also plastic bullshit. I don't like to invest the time in stupid things. That is also something I would suggest you to do. Use your time for the good things in life. That brings you further on in life. We have here Hanuta Brownie, by the way. We have also different Duplo flavorings. Anyway. Oh, guys, here's the Hanuta Black and White. This is quite nice. Very good milk cream. Okay, guys, so now let's open the gigantic Kinder Surprise egg. And guys, look at here my background. I don't know if you like this, but I did everything so that I can feel like in a little wonderland. So, guys, I will open this here. Look what is inside. Oh, guys, it's almost falling out here. We have many, many small surprise eggs and also Kinder Joy. I will open Kinder Joy first because we had already the basic surprise eggs. So, guys, let me open this thing. So, we have two things. One is for the candies and one is for the for the toy, and as you might notice here in the video, I don't like the toys. And when I see this, I have no affection towards building this. This goes directly in the trash because I'm more the candy kind of fetishist. This is good, guys. This is here high quality. 
I don't know how to eat it. Ah, guys, there's a, oh, guys, the microphone is falling down here from my, from my shirt, basically. Guys, this is, I believe, um, guys, to be honest, when I eat this now, I need silence because enjoying the quality things in life is not easy when there's a camera on you. So I will now end this video and you saw all the different surprise eggs. And guys, we have so many special things here. Look at this. Look at this Kinder Schokobons Crispy. This is from Arabia. Arabia is, <laughs> we slaughter gay people, uh, no comment, but uh, this is a political kind of situation there, over there, over the sea. So, yeah, okay guys, that's it for today, see you in the next video, bye bye. Hey guys, I'm your German candy taster, the best candy taster in the world, most accurate in the rating. And today we will taste all the different Ferrero kind of products, Kinder products that you can buy. So let's not lose time, let's directly start with the basic Kinder Duplo Cocos. And guys, for me it's super interesting because I can taste all of these products and I don't know where to start. It's just so much and I will eat for the next week, I think until I have everything over. Duplo coconut, not the biggest fan, 7 out of 10. So directly Kinder Surprise Eggs, and if you guys know me, it's one of my favorite candies. <coughs> super good, super super good. I think Kinder Surprise Eggs gets directly 10 out of 10 because it's thin and I'm a fan of the thin kind of kind of product. So 10 out of 10. Okay guys, next up we have the Kinder Paradise. And this one is quite interesting because Kinder Paradiso is basically like a cake kind of thing. So we have here like a, like a cake, but with cream, and the Kinder Cream is always the best, guys. Oh, guys. Super good. Guys, it's sticking on my gown. Eight, of the, uh, eight out of ten in the rating. So next up we have a basic Kinder chocolate product. And this is a basic product. Directly 8 out of 10, basic. Okay guys, next up, what can we eat? I think this is quite good. Do you have a choice? Oh, please, can I taste it here? I know. Not this. Um, black Hanuta, white, black and white. Nine out of ten is the rating. Very, very good. Next up, we have the um, white chocolate, and that is very sweet, actually. White chocolate is more sweet than the dark one. I mean, most people know it. Guys, very good, good. 8 out of 10 solid product for the everyday usage. This is quite good. Oh, guys. Kinder Joy. I think Kinder Joy is um, pretty underrated. Look at this. We have cream, we have balls. Here, cream balls. Pretty underrated. 9 out of 10 in the rating. Guys, what else do we have? Ah, oh, this is something interesting. Oh, white bueno, why not? Come on, give it a taste. 
8 out of 10 in the rating. Hanuta cookies, guys. This is totally underrated in my opinion. <clears throat> I need it every day. 10 out of 10. Guys, I have problems with the jam candy taste the mac here, just for the eating experience. Great, great, great product. Guys, what else do we have here? The giant Kinder eggs. Oh, guys, Kinder Cards. Mm. Nine out of ten. Also underrated for a cookie kind of product. So it's not the ten, it's not white chocolate. I need white chocolate for a ten out of ten product. Or at least milk cream. Oh, guys, white milk cream. <laughs> It's good, it's good. You can say anything about it, against it. Uh, guys, Nutella. I'm not the biggest fan of Nutella, to be honest with you guys. I mean, it's eatable. <laughs> But Nutella is so not sweet in my taste. I don't know why the, all the people love it so much. Sugar bones. Directly gone. Super, super fast. I'm the one of the fastest eater of Kinder Sugar bones. Small Bueno, oh guys, Kinder Pinguin! <laughs> 8 out of 10, it's a bit not sweet enough, it's too dark from the chocolate kind of taste. Kind of rice, kind of taste. Too dark in the taste. Guys, have you ever seen Kinder Delight. This is quite interesting. This is like a brownie. Like a, like a cake kind of candy. Not sweet enough. Awful. 3 out of 10. Forget it. Forget it. Don't buy. So. I mean, the, the um, basic product, Kinder Bueno, goes always, guys. It's, uh, it, it, it's no-brainer. You don't have to think about it. it no, no second thought. It goes always, all the time. So what? Uh, oh, guys. Guys, basic Duplo. No special editions. Because I have here so many special editions. I mean, it's it normal Duplo goes always 7 out of 10 in the rating. Oh, guys, what do I see here? Uh, oh, guys, this is big, big kind of, kind of chocolate. Oh, look at the brain. Guys, I have so big. Everything is big on the German candy taster. Um, yeah, what else do we have? I think this is enough for today. I would say see you in the next video when I eat the rest of the candy products. Guys, I love you. See you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. Hey, guys. In today's video, we will deal with a deep kind of topic. It's crazy. I am not sure if I can do it in English because I'm from Germany, from Deutschland, bin ich. Um, deshalb wird, that's why it's going to be a bit hard for me to put in the words. Um, but I do my best and I want to help you because this will change your completely life. Okay, guys. So listen, you guys consist out of what? What do you think?
Papa Gamba, for what? You, he has no idea, he's stupid. Uh, so anyway, you consist out of uh, materie, uh, like the atom kern, basically. Okay, listen, this is interesting. The center of the um, atom kern, uh, atom, I don't know the English word, is like when you compare it to a football field. And the football is the same size as the middle of the I mean, you consist out of neutrons, electrons, uh, atoms, and the atom's kern is basically the same size as the football, and it's laying on the uh, middle point of the football field. Now is the question, the next um, Teilchen, the next neutron from this thing in your body, how far is it away, Bob? From like when the uh, atom kern is in the middle of the field, and the next uh, materie thing from this in your body, how far is it away? In the maßstab of the football field. Close? Close? No. Far away? Yeah. Guess how, how far away? When the one Teilchen is in the middle of the football field, where is the next one around? Daniel, it's 11 kilometers. So, What does that mean? It's crazy. You can consist out of nothing, basically, and you can choose. You can choose who you are because every second you are a new person, and this is so crazy because Geist bewegt Materie. Everything is mind. If you read the Kibalion, read it. Philosophy from 2,500 years ago. They wrote it on a stone uh, tafel. Anyway. Uh, everything is mind in this world. So that means that because we consist out of nothing, and this is uh, uh, Wissenschaft, this is science, this is not, I don't come this up with this, this is science, quantum physics, physics. They found it out. And in between, what is in between? We don't know, nothing. And you can fill it with whatever you want it to be full with. So if you say, I eat candies because I want to become a candy myself, then you just have to eat a lot of candies and you fill out the gaps in between of the Teilchen. And then irgendwann wirst du selber eine Süßigkeit. Um, yeah, that is one thing, but also mind. So if you have a problem, and guys, I can totally understand you, you have problems, everyone has problems. When, for example, your mom died, Oh, let's say your mom died is a natural kind of situation. Uh, let's say when your daughter died. I can understand it's quite difficult. But what now, how does it help you with your consciousness with the um, atom 11 kilometers? Guys, you are not, you wouldn't understand it. You wouldn't understand it. That's why I'm not going to say it to you. <laughs> anyway, guys, you guys know what I want to say, right? Do you know what I want to say? Bob? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, forget it. This guy is hilarious. <laughs> He's hilarious. This is one of the guys of the kind. <laughs> Anyway, so if this is a, like a universe, planet in the universe, and this is you, and you are floating around the universe, now everything that counts is you, is the universe? No, everything that counts is the moment, because there is no past and there is basically no future. Because if there were only uh, animals in the world, existing, then there would be no future and no past, because animals only live in the moment. And now you have to adapt this to yourself. If you basically think that the past and you identify with something you ever experienced in the past and you put it to the present, it's not healthy. Live in the moment, live in the now. Everything that you have achieved in your past is not important in the now. In the now and the future doesn't exist also because it's your mind 
that creates it. If there were animals, there wouldn't be no future and no past. So basically that is the proof that everything that consists in the future, in the past, is in our mind only. Because if we were not there, there wouldn't be anything else than the exactly the moment now. So you have to live in the moment, that is important. And also one other tip, uh, how long is this video right now? Six minutes. Then I can give you more of my uh, spiritual thoughts. Uh, what can give you something? Uh, okay, listen. The mind, when everything is perfect, the mind is in peace. But when your heart is in peace, basically, everything is perfect. Let that sink in. Because what this means is basically, um, yeah, what this means is basically, if you act like your mind is the one and go to thing, then the light can shine on you from the outside. But then you are uh, abhängig, what is abhängig in English? Dependent on the opinion from the outside, from others. But if your heart is in peace, then everything is perfect and you don't need to do anything to get the attention from outside because then the light can shine out of you. And the difference is basically that the heart is, you have to do what the heart wants, what, what you feel inside and not what your mind says you. I'm, I'm, I mastered it. You guys are my students. You are not there yet. Yeah, anything. Uh, anyway, this is also uh, something useful. What else can I tell you? I have so many interesting thoughts in my head, guys. Another interesting thing is that there is no bad things in this world existing. Everything that is bad, for example, this is the Kinder Surprise Eggs and this is out of date. So the chocolate is a bit not fresh anymore, okay? Is it a bad thing? No, it's my opinion about it. And that is, you have to let that sink in. My opinion about it, my Erwartungshaltung, yeah? I had an expectation from it and it was different. That makes it a negative thing, but a negative thing doesn't exist in this world because it's just my opinion about the things. And this is as good as everything else, but because in my past I had the experience that it tasted different, now I have the expectation that it tastes exactly the same. This is so deep, you guys will never understand it directly. So you have to watch this video a few times. Anyway, what else can I tell you? I give you one more tip, uh, one more advice for your life. I, will, I think I will call this video like 10 minutes full of advices, life advices. This is so cool. Uh, guys, what else can I give you for an advice? Uh, Anhaftung. So everything that you that you connect with and that you identify yourself with is bad, verursacht light, it's negative. So um, you guys know me, I'm the German candy taster. But this is a part of my identity only, one part, and I have like three parts at least. I can be bubblegum bob at the same time. It's like whatever the anhaftung is das light also so everything yeah that is in your uh, surrounding that you connect with and that you make a part of your identity is negative for you so loslassen lotusgeist uh, let, let it here don't anhaft the like people around you don't depend on their Uh, 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 giving to you the feeling that you are happy, that it's not healthy. You have to be alone, happy, yeah? Alone with candies, of course. But guys, you don't need a lot of things in life. And that's what I want to tell you. It's in the life, many people want to accomplish to get material things. Yeah, basically, like a car. Why do they want a car? Because they want to impress their neighborhoods. 
but the neighbors don't care about them, but they think they care about them. The neighbors, oh, they are talking about me, but the neighbors are just talking about them so that they don't have to feel their own negative feelings. And that is something you have to remember. Negative feelings, you have to feel them in order to go through them and it's never good to put them aside. You have to feel it. And guys, now I have to look at the clock because I have to leave now. I have something else to do. But that, think about it, yeah? That are things that, like these things, you have to pay usually thousand dollars to coaching uh, therapists that you get these things. And I give them to you for free. So you can be a bit more thankful, maybe. Hmm? PayPal link in the description, maybe. <laughs> guys, you know what I want to say you. See you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. Hey, guys, I'm your German candy taster. And as you can see, I bought so many candies. And for today, I will test for you guys all the cold products from Kinder. And I have basic products like Kinder Milchschnitzel, I have Kinder Maxi King, I have um, a Kinder Pingui Kokos Nuts. And guys, what is very interesting kind of thing, kind of fact, is I have the old and the new Kinder Kokos and they have a new receptor. So I'm super curious how this is going to taste. So let's directly start with Kinder Maxi King. And guys, I haven't yet eaten a candy product today because I was, I knew that we were filming this video. So, basic product, milk cream, caramel, and also here hazelnut from the outside. So this is in the rating, guys. And you know me, I have the most accurate rating in the world. Eight out of 10. Because let's say it's very intensive. So I will give another one to the camera guy because he also knew that we were filming this today and he didn't have candy for the whole day. Here, take it. Take it. It's my present to you. Mm. So next up we have here Kinder Milchschnitzel and this is a classic guys. I mean for Milchschnitzel my favorite thing is basically the cream. But I'm falling so with my mess. So the cream directly 10 out of 10 in the rating. And the black thing, I don't know, maybe five in the rating. So that was Kinder Milchmittel. Oh guys, my... <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> my shirt is coming down. <laughs> you want to see me naked, I know. Okay, so next up we have here Kinder Paradiso. And the special thing about Kinder Paradiso is it's basically like a cake, kind of, kind of thing. So we have here cheesecake with cream inside. So I'm super curious how this is going to taste. <laughs> it's super good. Actually, <laughs> Richard is laughing. He doesn't know I like the cake. Guys, actually I thought cake is more for the older generation. Also quite good. Eight out of 10 in the rating. So guys, next up we have the basical basically Kinder Pingui and guys I haven't eaten this in a long long time so usually I eat this once a week I haven't eaten it for like four months but this is more like for the dark chocolate kind of fan um, super intensive in the taste very extreme Intensity is like cacao kind of rice. Gets 8 out of 10 also. Um, yeah, it's for in between, it's, it's great, but for my taste, it's not sweet enough. So we are still looking for the 10 out of 10 kind of product, which will be the winner. So now, very interesting. Um, I will compare now Kinder Pingui Coco, the new version, versus the old version. And guys, you know me, I have the most accurate rating kind of rice always. And as you can directly see, come look at this. Here the old one is lighter than the uh, new one. And also the old one has here the coconut on it. So from the first 
kind of impression Ultron gets the point, but we will see how it's going to pay. Very good, very good, new one. <laughs> Guys, it's funny. It's very funny because actually the old one is quite better. They, you see it all over the place. They always change the receptor and it's always worse than it was. So we have it also from Nutella. <coughs> Guys, I have also here Nutella somewhere. Um, they change the recipes and it's getting worse and worse. So the old one gets more points than the uh, new one. The old one gets 8 out of 10 in the rating. New one gets 9 out of 10. Oh guys, what's this? Wing wing banana phone. <laughs> Little joke in between. So, funny how the old one was quite better than the new one. And now because guys, I know you think I always eat candy so unhealthy. You guys know me. I'm a responsibility of a guy and I always eat fruits and vegetables also. So, I have here Kinder Pingui Cherry with real cherry flavoring. How is it going to taste for the vitamins? Okay. <coughs> totally not my taste. Way too healthy. I don't know. I don't like it at all. It's just bad. So guys, what's uh, missing, I think we, ah guys, Kinder Sugar Fresh, and I know from uh, the guy behind the camera, this is his favorite kind of candy, so let's give it to him directly, take it in your mouth, guys, this is quite funny. Hey, this is so cool, right? We can, and this is all because of you, yeah? That I have the uh, possibility to, to get all these candies because of you. It's only because of the fans. Loyal fans. So, Kinder Sugar Fresh, it's more nutty in the taste. Guys, they changed the recipe. I can taste it directly. Did they change it? Yes, they changed it. They... Guys, this is not a joke. They had over 40 grams sugary. Now they have uh, 39. This is a change. It made it uh, worse. So, guys, what can I say in total? I like the Kinder candy products, but is there a 10 out of 10 product? No, it's, there's no 10 out of 10 product. Mostly because they changed the recipe to a better, uh, better uh, worse one, but all in all it's good candies, you can eat it in between, it's good for your mental health, for getting, starting the day right, stuff like that. So yeah guys, this is it for this video, I hope you really, ah guys, we have one more cold product and I want the camera guy to get it, it's in the fridge, in the lower fridge here, down, yes, guys, this is a surprise for him, he doesn't know it. <laughs> He had no idea. Fire. Yes, it is. You can directly see. Guys, you know, my nose is the best candy nose, nose in the world. Mango? No, no, it's a down here. Down, left, 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 left. No, left to it. No, it's the game. Go, go away with it. This is bullshit. Yeah. Guys, and I'm super curious. I haven't tasted this before. This is basically Kinder Bueno White. Ice cream. <sighs> Guys, super, super curious how this is going to taste. If it's quite good, quite bad. This is how it looks. Kinder Bueno ice cream. Well, I really hope you're not standing in the way for the, for the main camera. Guys, this is also the first try with multiple camera settings, so don't be mad if it's not perfect. I'm not a machine, guys, okay? So, and uh, with the Gen Candy Taster mask, uh, how am I going to eat it? I don't know, we'll find a way, so.
Interesting. Guys, what I can say directly, uh, the cream is basically ice cream, but this here is the interesting part. So look at this. The basical cream is basical ice cream, and this is here the more interesting kind of thing. Candy. Look how very good. Oh, the fridge is not um, closed yet. Guys, directly 9 out of 10 in the rating. I directly have the rating. Um, the thing around, very good. This is basical white Kinder Bueno, but um, the ice cream, yeah, that's uh, basical. Guys, <laughs> this is how I eat it. Guys, <laughs> crazy. Okay, that's it for today. Really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, 9 out of 10 in the rating for the Kinder Bueno ice cream. Um, yeah, I really hope, give me also feedback about this whole setting. Do you like it? There will come more videos, of course. Guys, to be honest, I will upload now one year again, because I, you know, it's, uh, I'm the kind of business guy. Okay, see you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. Hey guys, I'm your German candy taster. Today I have to be a bit rude to my fans. Um, guys, something happened. Um, we are going to talk about this today. First of all, because I never showed it in any video, look at this bag. This is a bag full of Kinder ca candies, and this is like, this, how cool is this? You can put this on your thing. I have here the giant Kinder guy. Anyway, so I just wanted to show this to you. Um, I'm a bit disappointed by my fans kind of thing. You guys know all the political situation right now with the inflation, with the decreasing of the bitcoins, the cryptocurrencies. And also there is a big thing going on in the candy industry, in the candy world, because everything is getting more expensive basically. So when I see a Kinder Surprise Eggs, I bought this two years ago for 59 cents, basically. So when I now look at this with the inflation, in addition to this, this would be somewhere around, let's say one third in the last 10 years, maybe it's, let's say it's now 85 cents. That would be a reasonable price due, due to the uh, inflation. But how much do you have to pay for this in the store? You know, no, no idea. Guys, sometimes over one euro for this. And I mean, I have the money. You know, my channel here is going quite well. I have one video with almost 14 million views. You can count uh, for 1000 views, you get around seven euros. So that is maybe around 30 or 40,000 euros. That's a lot. Um, but I can, I just want to show you. I don't want to show off, but I want to tell you I have no money problems. But where is the problem with putting this over one euro? The problem is not many families have now the money to buy good quality sugar products and candies. And this has, is a, has always a big impact in society happiness. There's a happiness rate that you can measure. And for the last two years, since everything got so expensive here, uh, it went down and down. So the happiness is equivalent to the amount of sugary that you can buy for your money. And I mean, I understand the families. When you have, let's say, 2000 euros per month, for five people, I totally get it that you don't have money to buy Kinder Surprise eggs. You buy, for example, uh, the chocolate surprise eggs from the supermarket, for example, from Ja, from Rewe. I don't have this low quality candies here, but this has an impact on your inner health, basically, because you can't afford the good things anymore in life. And this has 
a very, I mean, we need consciousness in this world to end the war in Ukraine. You know, it's all the bad things happen. This is because people are not satisfied with their lives. And we, the industry, the candy industry, and I'm talking especially to Ferrero, because Ferrero has the money. I know it. I know a lot of people at Ferrero. I have the connections. You can, can probably guess. I'm the German candy taster in Ferrero, Germany. I know a lot of people. That's why I have, for example, this surprise egg that you can't buy in the store. Um, yeah, but I'm talking to you, Ferrero uh, people. Make it cheaper. Cheaper. Kinder Bueno costs 2 euros 39 cents in penny marked. That is too much guys it's it was like five years ago it was one you 39 or something the, many people can't afford it anymore and i'm here for the community of poor people i stand up for them you have to change basically the guidelines of the pride tax Uh, yeah, make it cheaper that everyone can buy it. World happiness. World is going to a conscious state of mind. Everybody knows it. If you listen to Sadhguru or also uh, Jay Shetty, they all know it. All the wise people know it. That we are going to a different kind of mind. Geistes uh, Zustand, basically. But we need consciousness. And for consciousness, we need happiness. Guys, I said everything that I can say anyway. So there's not more to say. That is my world to the people, to the companies. Make it cheaper. Everyone has to afford it. Otherwise, war is going to come. See you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. <laughs> hey, guys, I'm your German candy taste. And today I'm going to show you basically my fridge. And guys, this is how it looks. I have to close this in between because it's beeping, basically. So, basically, let's go through all the different kinds of layers and then I will show you how I thought it. <sighs> Guys, I'm a bit out of breath. I'm not the youngest anymore. So, basically, let's start here in the door. So, in the door, I have here my uh, sugar bongs, basically white ones and black ones. Here I have snacks for in between, Kinder cereal for the breakfast, and this is here for the um, for the uh, uh, for the visit. When I have a then I give it to Hanuta. So uh, here I have my Kinder Joys, basically six or seven for normal week, and here is klein krams. There is alles Mögliche. There is everything inside. Yeah, this is something special for Christmas kind of period in life. And have you ever seen this kind of packaging? This is quite unusual. So this is basically, there's not a lot of structure in this area. So let's get right to this here. So we have in this area, we have all the uh, surprise eggs that I need for my everyday basic needs. Here is the... Uh, Look at the material, it's metal. So, uh, here I have my Kinder Riegel. So I can take one every hour of the day. I have here. So, uh, okay, so here are the Kinder Surprise Egg. What do I have here? I don't know. Can I have a look for Kinder Bueno? Uh, guys, I, for me it's important that I have Kinder Bueno in every, basically in every layering. So that, because this is a, um, one of the most eaten it, so if you open this also full of Kinder Bueno, oh, I have to close it for the beeping mechanism. So the beeping mechanism stopped. So here in the lower structure area, we have all the cold products, like Kinder Milchschnitte, Kinder Cherry, basically, Kinder Milchschnitte, and also Kinder Paradiso. Guys, this is like the cake from Kinder, Ferrero Kinder.
guys, I have so much. This is no flex, but sometimes I just destroy it for my anger problems. So here is another special kind of product. This is Kinder Creamy. You get it only in different countries here. In which countries? Guys, I can't see it in which countries. It's not from Germany. And also, what's also special, guys, let me check for you guys. Our Kinder cards. I know in some countries you don't have these, so if you watch it from the USA, <laughs> losers. We have this in Germany, this kind of stuff. You have to come to Germany. Kinder Bueno in the uh, soft packagings. Normal product. Another one, Kinder and um, Bueno White. I eat this all the day. Oh, guys, this is a special product, Kinder Delight. And also Kinder Duplo Speculatius. This is for the Weihnachts Christmas time. Then I say to my family, I have also cookies. Guys, as you can might notice, I'm a bit unmotivated to do this video because, because of reason. So, what else can I tell you guys? Guys, this is interesting. funny. I just destroyed the thing. <laughs> Look at this. Go away, please. You guys know I'm one of the strongest of the tasters. If you compare me to others on YouTube, junk food taster, he has arms like these. So, look what I can do. Anyway, guys, so the rest of the fridge is basically Guys, this is the kind of flex that I can do. Most people can't do this. This is like the new world. Uh, in the old world we had like Rolex kind of status symbols, AP, and now we have the destroying mechanism of the candy products. If you can do, you can do. <laughs> anyway, guys, so <laughs> this is basically it for my fridge. Uh, see you in the next video. And that was a very spontaneous kind of video. <laughs> see you in the next video. Bye bye, guys. Yeah, show them. Show them. Tasty, delightful, uplifting kind of stuff.